Hello, dear all. Hope that you all are safe and staying at home with due precautions. And uh, as you are aware that this is in continuation of our previous lectures for the subject of Rug Nidana and Vikriti Vigyan that has been delivered by our esteemed faculty members before this lecture. So our today's topic is Atisar and uh, I hope that you must be remembered that I have uh, covered Agni Mand before this lecture. So in continuation of that I am starting this lecture uh, for your class. So first of all we will uh, discuss the derivation or nirukti of this uh, disease Atisar which is uh, composed by two words. First is uh, Ati which is Upsharg and in Srudhatu it is added as Atisar. Ati. So Atisar consists of two words Rudhatu and Ati is added as Upsar. Ati means that there is either increased in frequency or there is increased in amount. Both have been considered by this word, single word Ati. Either there is increased frequency of is two, either there is increased amount of fluid is two stool that is rich in fluids, fluid. So these two things consist word at sar which you can see as uh, Achar Vijay Rachit has stated Guden Bahudra Saradam when excessive amount of stool which is rich in fluid is passed out through the anus that condition is known as Atisar and in the same word in the second phase you are uh, looking at the screen which says Atiyu Saratya Atisare Gude. The same meaning is also there and this statement is uh, written by uh, Acharya Sharankar. So both of these uh, deri uh, derivation reflects that any disorder which is characterized by either increased amount of fluid rich stool or there is increased frequency of stool that is rich in fluid is passed out through the rectum. The condition is known as Atisar. This is the derivation of the word Atisar and this is the normal feature of the disease Atisar. And uh, Second is its mythological derivation. And I, uh, when you will see a Charak Chikitsa Sthan, uh, chapter 19, uh, there is an indication in which Achar Charak says that there was a king known as Pughas Pughastra. He was offering Jag, and during that Jag, uh, the cow meat was served to the various acharyas. So that leads to or origin of Atisar in those acharyas who consumed cow milk. Uh, in that phrase, Achar Charak had stated that it has the properties of Guru, Oshun. So it causes abnormality in the Agni and that leads to the Atisar. Basically, Atisar is again characterized by the Agnimand, which is the principal feature in the origin of Ag Atisar. Uh, Achar uh, Susrut have educated that there are three disorders, Arsh, Atishar and Krahdi, which are primarily based on the status of Agni. When the status of Agni is good, their manifestation is at the lower level are there they become absent. In the character of Gatatishar, you will see later on, the uh, Achar Susrut and Achar Madho have stated that Deep Tagnir Lagu Postas. 
ओके फूस अग्नि बिकम्स गुड देन डिजीज इज क्योर सो दीज थ्री डिसऑर्डर्स अर्थ अचार एंड ग्रहणी आर बेस्ड ऑन द स्टेटस ऑफ अग्नि एंड अग्नि मान प्लेस इम्पॉर्टेंट रोल इन द ओरिजिन ऑफ स्पीसीज ऑफ अतिसार सो दिस दिस इज वेरी क्रिटिकल स्टेटमेंट आर सो मेनी प्लेसेज दर योर योर एग्जामिनर्स आस्क द नेम ऑफ डिजीज विच आर प्राइमरली बेस्ड ऑन द अग्नि सो दैट इज अर्थ अतिसार एंड ग्रहणी एंड वन मोर थिंग यू विल सी देर इन द चैप्टर ऑफ उदर रूल है ना देर इज ऑल्सो मंदाग्नियाम चौबीसा दैट उदर रूल इज ऑल्सो कैरेक्टराइज बाय द मंदाग्नि सो इट बिकम्स फोर बट आचार्य सुश्रुत हैज एडवोकेटेड मेनली थ्री डिजीज ही हैज कम्बाइंड नेम ऑफ अर्थ अचार एंड ग्रहणी इन वन कंटेस्ट एंड इन अदर कंटेस्ट हैव स्टेटेड दैट उदर रोग इज ऑल्सो मैनिफेस्टेशन ऑफ मंदाग नाम च विशेषता सो इन नट सेल वी विल सी दैट अग्नि प्लेज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इन द ओरिजिन ऑफ अतिसार लेटर ऑन एज आई वी विल डिस्कस इन द कंटेस्ट ऑफ निदान सो नाउ वी विल सी द टॉपिक ऑफ निदान now we will discuss about the nidan of the atisar uh, the phrase we have i have mentioned is this in the slide is mainly taken from the madhav nidan so uh, this is the general nidan of the atisar disease whereas achar charak susrut and others have educated the specific nidan for particular type of atisar that is uh, they have mentioned different uh, nidan for vata jatsar and pitta jatsar and kapha jatsar whereas achar madho had uh, collectively uh, given the common nidan for all of these and consuming different type of nidan may lead to the different type of atisar that that is based on the intake which causes vitiation of particular disease say if we are taking uh, vatas nidan which is mentioned in these nidan that will lead to the mandagni and further th that causes vatas itsar so this is the collective nidan for all and intake of particular nidan say viruddhasya abhyashan that will lead a particular type of uh, atisar that may lead to vatas either vatas type of or pittas type of yeah you can say that there is a shokad you know that there is mentioned they have mentioned more nidan shokad so you know that uh, shok causes vitiation of vat so that may lead to the vata jatsar or that may lead to the shoka jatsar but we will discuss that what is difference between shoka jatsar and uh, vata jatsar now this is a common uh, just a example that shok leads to the vitiation of what uh, you will see in the contest of jor where achar charak have stated kaam shok bhayat vayu and krodhat pittam means kaam shok and bhay leads to the vitiation of vat dosh whereas uh, krodh leads to the vitiation of pitta dosh so out of these if a person is uh, having in the state of shok so that may lead to the vata jatsar that may lead to the shoka jatsar so uh, as i told you that i will discuss it that what is the difference between vata jatsar and shoka jatsar this is a, just an example so uh, these is are the collective nidans and i will let you know the particular nidan in the contest of particular type of atisar and means i will s inform you the nidans of particular type of atisar in the contest of their specific uh, symptom so uh, i am just saying it that these are the common nidans 
and we will discuss it here that uh, madho achar madho has uh, said that uh, guru ati smit ruksh oshna do stul ati sitale viruddha dashan ajirne visme shapi bhujne snehat der ati yuktesh hmm? snehat der ati yuktesh mithya yukter vishar bhay shokat dusht ambu madhya ti pane and shatn ritu parre chala bhi ramale begair vidhat विधाते एंड क्रिमी दोस्त नाम भवत अतिसारो आई हैव नॉट रिटन सम वर्ड्स इन दिस कंटेस्ट दिस जो आई हैव मेंशनड ओनली द कंटेस्ट ऑफ मिदानेस गुरु अति स्मित गुरुच ओ दो इज टू लेट सी द विरुद्ध दशन अजीरणे विस्मेश चापी भोजने स्नेहा दरति टेस्ट मिथ्या इस पर विषय है शोकात दुष्टांबु मत जाति पाने साथ में ऋतु पर रहे जला भी रमण और बेघर विधाते क्रिमी दोस्त है these are the factors which cause atisar so uh, we will discuss each word in detail here according to yogi guru of achar and here guru what guru means no guru a guru reflects two or three things it reflects either we are consuming a specific diet which is very excessive in amount means guru matra it is guru in matra it is excessive in the amount uh, just, just just taking a hack very heavy meal that may lead to the uh, vitiation of agni agni mans that may lead to or it also reflects to the uh, intake of particular uh, diet which has uh, guru gun you know which is swabhavata guru in gun just like uh, intake of rakta shali you know yes sorry uh, it, it is just uh, intake of mash mash is guru in having I mean guru gun it uh, takes larger time to digest and third is pakta you know which is this which have a uh, guru pak you know there there are three type of pak guru pak and lagu pak so guru sab reflects three things either increased in the amount or increased that that have guru pak and which has swabhavata which is guru that so there are three things by word one word intake of excessive amount of particular uh, diet which is guru or intake of a particular an which has guru gun or intake of particular an which is guru in pak that all three leads to the atisar in one context or it is very untuous you know intake of untuous diet you know or you can say which is very dry third is okay, that that is very dry have a very uh, dry that that may cause to uh, vitiation of liver and which is very oshna you know so oshna and sital there are two words you will say ruksh oshna and then the last phrase you can see that sital so oshna and sital these reflects two properties of a particular uh, diet and there is oshna in asparsh or sital in asparsh yeah having oshna here or sital in asparsh both of these has been indicated by आचार्य माधव एच शीतलम या उष्णम स्पर्श वीर्याच मींस आइदर देयर इज स्पर्श शीत और शीत वीर बोथ ऑफ दीस हैज बीन इंडिकेटेड एज द निदान ऑफ द अतिसार एंड आई स्कूल आई स्कूल दिस वाज वेरी कॉम्पैक्ट मींस नो स्कूल दिस इज हैवी यू कैन से दैट डाइट व्हिच इज अगेन हैवी एंड which is very compact may lead to the atisar and now the, there is viruddha dashan now you all know what is viruddha dashan uh, virudh viruddha dashan mat karo viruddha it is kind of viruddha and you must know that there are 18 types of viruddha it is written by acharya jagat intake of either of that either of 18 types of viruddha 
क्या आइदर यू कैन से दैट संयोग विरुद्ध देश विरुद्ध काल विरुद्ध मात्रादि विरुद्धम लाइक दे नो शेर मत से सो देयर आर सो मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ विरुद्ध आर इन टेक ऑफ एनी टाइप ऑफ विरुद्ध आर रेगुलर इन टेक ऑफ एनी टाइप ऑफ एनी ऑफ दैट टाइप ऑफ विरुद्ध आर मे लीड टू द वैशिएशन ऑफ पर्टिकुलर टाइप ऑफ दोष आइदर वॉर चित कफ आर संसर्ग और संपात दैट मे लीड टू द अतिशाप एंड देर इज अजीर्ण विरुद्ध सदशन अजीर्ण है ना तो वॉट इज अजीर्ण कहता है कि इन टेक ऑफ डाइट इन द स्टेट ऑफ अजीर्ण तो ना यू कैन से भोक्तम पूर्वान्न से है वेन द डाइट यू हैव टेकन इट्स अनडाइजेस्टेड देन अगेन taking uh, diet in a very short interval of first intake so first one was not properly digested then again you have taken uh, someone has taken the diet that may lead to the atisar that is known as adhyashan you know virudh then then sir adhyashan and there is ajir and then there is vishbhay chapi bhojana these are the properties which are related to that bhojana uh, that is that sir vishmay chapi bhojana other uh, what is bisham uh, bhojan that is known as bahu stomam bisham means bahu stomam or akale now there are two things bahu stomam akale va tach geham bishmasam bahu stom kal means if you are regularly taking food at uh, at around 2 o'clock and then you start taking food either at 12 o'clock 11 o'clock or 5 o'clock that is known as vishmasham it not taking diet at the proper time which you are following uh, some lot longer time if you st- start taking food either before that time or after that time that is known as vishmasna that is bahu isto kam bahu isto kam akaleva that is known as vishmasna that also leads to the diarrhea as uh, when you take uh, food at a regular time it becomes very normal that your agni becomes at its peak level at that time you know at around that time so in take of food before that time or after that time that agni becomes some abnormal during that time yeah, that 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 not remains at its peak level so that may lead to the atisar and then again there is snehat dair ati uspech मिथ्यायुस पैच नो दे आर टू थिंग्स देयर स्नेहा देयर अतियुस पैच और मिथ्यायुस पैच इट मींस दैट इफ हां देयर इज अतियोग और मिथ्यायोग ऑफ स्नेहा देयर मींस इफ देयर इज अतियोग और मिथ्यायोग ऑफ पंच पैच ना पूर्ण कर एंड प्रधान कर दैट इज आल्सो इंडिकेटेड एज द कॉस्टिक फैक्टर फॉर अतिसार इफ यू विल सी द Uh, complication of mithya yoga or ati yoga in the context of panch karm there is clear cut mention of atisar in the complication of these two panch karm mithya yoga or panch karm uh, ati yoga leads to the atisar and then there is vishaya so an uh, intake of particular type of poison vis and bha so what are there are two types of vis one is asthavar vis and there is चांगम बिस है ना सो देर आर हियर वट बी से अस्थावर बिस है ना इट इज नॉट द चांगम बिस इट इज अ काइंड ऑफ अस्थावर बिस एज इट हैज टेंडेंसी टू मूव डाउनवर्ड्स इट हैज टेंडेंसी टू मूव डाउनवर्ड्स इट इज सो अस्थार हैव ऑल्सो टेंडेंसी ऑफ moving the stool downwards very frequently so mainly asthavar vis causes uh, atisar and you know, whereas acharas has already indicated that uh, intake of jangam vis leads to vomit and intake of asthavar vis leads to atisar so in the context of vis we must know that it is a kind of asthavar vis and you know, and also there is दूसरी विस सो अस्थावर विस एंड दूसरी विस हियर विस रिफ्लेक्ट्स 
two types of bits one is dosi bit and other is a power bit dosi bit slowly flow, slowly vitiates the dose and leads to the star which has tendency to cause a star whereas a power bit causes a star due to atho adhogatatva it has tendency to move downward so it causes a star and then again bhay and shlokas we have already mentioned that kaam shok bhayat vai kaam shok and bhay leads to the vitiation of what so bhay and shok leads to the vitiation of what that causes atchar and again we have mentioned that these are two types of atchar also bhay and shok as we will discuss later on so along with this uh, dusht ambu intake of vitiated water now which contain contaminated by any type of poison or any type of foreign material or any type of dust or any type of soa that may lead to the atisha you know and intake of excessive much alcohol it, it it also causes atisha and there is satna ritu parya the two words are there either in satna parya satna parya means asat just opposite to the things which are sat in take of those things which are which become homologous is known as sat and in take of those things which are not homologous means they are asat they all lead to the atisat and there is ritu parya na just opposite to that particular ritu so that also leads to atisat and one is jala bhi ramadayati excessive uh, sport like activity yeah excessive uh, activity which happens in the revolved pond that also causes atisar and then comes vegair vidhak vidhakar you know vegair vidhak we mean separation of natural objects here uh, there are certain types of natural objects here vegair vidhakar reflects the separation of either and mood or puris as stated by the achar maso that we all we have clearly indicated that only two type of veg vidhak leads to atisat and then comes krimi dosh karna means if there is origin of any type of krimi in the intestine that may also lead to atisat you will see in the context of krimi the atisat is the normal feature of normal symptom of krimi no niram bhot gati sare lakshan tat lakshan se it it this is the caustic factor so you will see uh, just i telling you the symptom of krimi so joro vivaradta shulam vid rogam sagnam bhrama joro vivaradta shulam vid rogam sagnam bhrama bhrama bhakt dvesh atisat krimi naam samanya lakshana matlab bhakt dvesh and atisat atisat is the general symptom of krimi means atisat is also caused by the particular type of krimi so these are dhruv bhajan atishmit bhajan bhushan yeah up to the krimi they all leads to atisar by vitiating different doshas by interfering in different in their function at different level so these are the nidan of the atisar so uh, we will discuss a particular nidan for water jastar in the context of water uh, atisar that is the jastar in the context of water jastar the common atisar which is evocated by the achar madhu as i have mentioned in the slide and now we will discuss uh, uh, some property of the atisar that is pathogenesis uh, आचार्य माधव हैज एडुकेटेड संप्राप्ति ऑफ द अतिसार एज शमसम्य अपाम धातुर अग्नि प्रविध शक्रिन मिश्रो वायुना अध प्रणुना सरत्य अतियु व अतिसारम दिस इज द पैथोजेनेसिस एंड दैट अगेन इन कंटिन्यूएशन 
तमाहुर व्याधिम शोर घोरम षडविदम तम बदंती है ना तो वे विल डिस्कस अबाउट द इनिशियल फेज ऑफ संप्राप्ति दैट इज समसम में अपाम धातुर अग्निम प्रोत्थ शक्रिन मिश्रो वायुना अध प्रणुना सरत्य अतिसारम दिस इज द संप्राप्ति ऑफ द अतिसार तो हियर जस्ट मेक डिफरेंट फ्रेगमेंट ऑफ द फर्स्ट लाइन दैट से समसम में अपाम धातुर अग्निम प्रवृत्ता दिस इज दैट इट सीम्स दैट इट सेज दैट समसम में अपाम धातुर अग्निम प्रवृत्ता दैट इज नॉट एक्चुअली इट इज समसम में अग्निम एंड अपाम धातुर प्रवृत्ता मीन्स ड्यू टू रेगुलर इनटेक ऑफ एटियोलॉजिकल फैक्टर्स वी डिस्कस्ड इन ऑल इयर साइड सो द रेगुलर इनटेक ऑफ द एटियोलॉजिकल फैक्टर्स काजेस अपाम धातुर प्रवृत्ता मीन्स रेगुलर इनटेक काजेस समसम में अग्नि अग्निमांत एंड दैट लीड्स टू द प्रवृद्धि ऑफ अपाम धातु और इंक्रीज इन द अमाउंट ऑफ जल धातु अपाम मीन्स जल या फ्लूट दैट इज आइदर देर इज इंक्रीज इन द क्वान्टिटी और क्वालिटी ऑफ द गुणात्मक या मात्रात्मक आइदर गुणात्मक वृद्धि और देर इज अ मात्रात्मक वृद्धि ऑफ अपाम धातु ड्यू टू अग्निमांत एट दिस इंक्रीज अमाउंट ऑफ वॉटर गेट मिक्सड विद द सकृत दैट मेक्स इट फ्लूड रिच विच वी अर्लियर डिस्कस दैट इन अतिशार देर इज पॉसिंग ऑफ फ्लूड रिच टाइट तो ड्यू टू इंक्रीज अमाउंट ऑफ फ्लूड विच गेट मिक्स विद द शक्रित कंसिस्टेंसी ऑफ द स्टूल इज चेंज एंड इट बिकम्स लिक्विड रिच तो दैट लिक्विड रिच स्टूल गेट पास थ्रू द रेक्टम विद द हेल्प ऑफ वात दोष वायु मीन्स अपान वायु वात दोष रिफ्लेक्ट अपान वायु दिस इज मैं इन द फंक्शन ऑफ अपाम धातु छेपता वहिर मलाना मीन्स अपाम धातु इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द डिफिकेशन मल मल निष्कासन सो इन नेट सेल यू कैन से देन ड्यू टू रेगुलर इनटेक ऑफ इटियोलॉजिकल फैक्टर्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल there is agnimant that agnimant leads to the uh, abnormal uh, absorption or secretion of the jal dhatu so that there is increased uh, amount of ya yeah, qualitative or quantitative uh, increase in the fluid content of the intestine that increased content get mixed with the stool and that passes out frequently either in increased amount or increased frequently and this hold is known as atisar it comes out with a very velocity have a very fast velocity so some some apam dhatur due to agnimand there is increased in the amount of fluid which which gets mixed with the uh, stool and comes out through the rectum repeatedly in either increased frequency or increased amount due to vitiated upon vibe this is known as atisar this is the common samprapti and next word says tamahur vyadhim ghoram shad vidam tad badanti is it is of six types another disease which is of six types one is ekatsa sarvasas chapi doshair means either due to single dose that that means either it is of vatas pittas or kafas type or sandipatas type so there are four types due to particular dose or there is sandipatas and fifth is due to shok and sixth is due to arm amajatsa fifth is sokajatsar and sixth is amajatsar so there are six type of atisar uh, let it uh, 
Now uh, we will discuss that there are initial two lines of this uh, some property. You will find according to the definition of some property what we will uh, we have discussed in the reference of Nidan Panchak. You know what is the def uh, definition of some property that Yatha doser dostred yatha charm bisarkitam is nirvittir amyas yaso. Some property jati yakti. So these two lines, yatha doser dostred, how they have, uh, they get vitiated due to regular intake of those nidans. Yatha charm bisarkita, unka prasaran kase hua, that means they causes increased amount of fluid that get mixed with the stool. And how they cause disease that it, it comes out with from the rectum repeatedly or increased either increased in frequency or increased in amount. So this is this two line reflects the some definition of some property yatha dosena dustain yatha chan viselta nitpitta ramyasyaso some prapti jakti agti. And the last line uh, I am letting you or letting for you and uh, Kindly uh, let me know that which type of samprapti is represented by the last line that uh, that says ekaksa sarvasas chapi dosa soke nan anne sastha amin chokta which type of samprapti is advocated by achar in this line and now we are attacking you the types of samprapti there are six types of samprapti uh, which is sankhya pradhan with vikal balkal out of these six, the last line reflects which types of samprapti. Uh, I will be happy to know from your side. And uh, now uh, I am thanking you for this uh, session. And we will continue the rest of the topics in our next lecture. This is a uh, over from my side and uh, hope that uh, uh, you will inform me about the type of some property which is described by the model in last line which type of some property either sankhya pradhan nividhi vikal balkal which type is same and uh, thank you thank you okay okay <clears throat> thank you thank you all